The main mission that we have in this symposia is to bring together young early career scientists. All of these scientists are under 45 years of age and we bring them together for this symposia to tackle and discuss some of the most relevant scientific challenges that we have both in the Arab world and in the United States as well as across the world as a whole. By convening early career scientists who are not only diverse in their fields, but also geographically. We are building bridges of mutual understanding, and now this is very important to build long-lasting collaborations and make the world a better place. Over the course of the three days, the participants engage with each other and talk about what in their respective field of research is really cutting edge and frontiers. The goal of this is to develop the conversation to a high level of complexity. We want them to really develop the relationships and collaborations with each other and promote and sustain science in the Arab world with the benefit of multiple partners from the U.S. and the, uh, the Arab League. The benefits to participating in this symposium are numerous. For me personally, it was my first time visiting in that part of the world, the Middle East, and I was able to not only get firsthand experience with what it's like to, to live there, but to interact with the leading researchers from the region and to get their perspective and a lot of times on problems that I'm thinking about myself, but just from a different angle. So this year will be the third Arab American Frontiers meeting. I actually had the privilege of taking part in the first meeting in Kuwait City. And it was a great opportunity to network with people in the United States as well as in the region. I felt it was a, a very, very uh, good experience. And I've been talking about it at CALS for quite some time. And I'm very pleased now that the third conference in this series will be arriving to KAUST. I think KAUST is a very special place to host this. It's a unique experiment, and I think people will find us to be great hosts uh, for, this, for this meeting. I found this symposium one of the most interesting symposium or even meeting that I ever attended. It has several advantage or difference. First, it is participant driven. So the chair organizer committee are chosen from the participants of the previous uh, symposium. We'll try to gather all these researchers together in order to be complementary. Or so that means what the electrical engineers is doing, we'll try to complete and use their application for our purposes. So their purpose is to develop the technique and our purpose is to use this technique and to apply it for our research, for our purposes. It's a forum for young uh, Arab and uh, US scientists and researchers to present their work and to share experience. We will have uh, top speakers uh, in a very uh, hot topic, which is uh, sensing. Also, we will enjoy uh, visiting the KAUST facilities, which are impressive. This university is having state-of-the-art uh, equipment. So the attendees will get uh, a chance to participate in a Frontier Symposium, which is a great opportunity by itself, but also uh, will be able to interact with the scientists that work at KAUST and potentially establish collaborations. And I came here uh, for the first time, was really surprised by the quality of the facilities and more importantly the quality of the research that's being conducted. KAUST is a truly unique university setting. It has many leading researchers in the field across multiple disciplines and the diversity and the level of research that's conducted at KAUST will afford many of the participants the ability to network with some of these colleagues both within and outside their disciplines and the core laboratory at KAUST has the facilities to allow us to do this truly interdisciplinary high-level research with, with equipment that isn't available within one individual lab and that provides us with a unique opportunity to collaborate. The missions of KAUST in that connectivity and that interdisciplinary approach to research exactly match the missions of the Arab American Symposia, where our goal there is to also connect people, bring them together. What we provide in this, in this symposium itself is really a, a focused nature to the engagement and direct mechanisms. The mechanisms that we have are fellowship opportunities and the potential to engage with KAUST faculty members on faculty-driven collaboration. It is quite clear from our visit to KAUST that there is a very clear vision that promotes collaborative research, but also cross-disciplinary innovation. And this aligns very well with the goals and objectives of the Arab American Frontiers program.